Hello guys, today we're gonna talk about skipping on a Google account on a Doogie device. Right now we have a Doogie X series, this is the model X60L. Now we go we will we are stuck here basically. This device was reset to continue signing in with a Google account that was previously synced on this device. Okay, this device is not stolen, but for the sake of this video, I blocked this device with an email that I know of. But I will show you every step of it to unlock this device, even if you don't know the Gmail. Now, first we're gonna go on doogie.cc So we're gonna go on Doogie CC form. I'm gonna I will leave some links on the, on the description box. Make sure to check them. So uh, first we will need to download this. We will need to download Smartphone Flash Tool application, and after we will need the firmware, the original firmware from the Doogie official website so after downloading our firmware we will have uh, okay this will be our firmware downloaded it's zipped now we're gonna go on extract here and then we're gonna go Doogie we'll open the extracted folder and then we will find the empty this file the skater file the empty 6737M. Now, basically, what we, what we will do is that first we will load the skater file on the smartphone flash tool. Now, I have the file right here. Do the device. Okay, perfect. Okay. I'm downloading the files, but you won't be using this window here. We will go to format, to format, and on default, this will be like this: auto format flash. We will remove that and go to manual format flash. Then we'll need to find the begin address and format length. And to find those, we will open again our folder and open the skater file. Now, as you can see, we have a bunch of gibberish things here, but uh, we need but we need to find the FRP file. Okay, so after finding the FRP file. finding the FRP file just I'm gonna make sure to find those okay okay so there we have it we need the physical the linear start address that is this here I will leave it on the description below to make it easy on you for this specific device so we will copy this and we're gonna go on begin address and paste it uh, we cannot paste it I will write down that so it's the zero X six small capital A and Two, three, five zeros. I'm gonna go on format length, delete this too, and we're gonna go on partition side size, and we're gonna write down zero x and one, two, three, one hundred thousand. One, and basically we have one, two, three, four, five zeros. Okay, so. After doing this, we will we have the phone turned on. 
They're gonna turn off the phone. Okay, and we will need a USB cable connected primary to the PC. Now we're gonna connect the phone. We before I for, totally forgot. Before connecting the phone, we will hit start, and we're gonna connect the phone by the phone being turned off and we will wait so phone is turned off now we will disconnect from the cable and turn on the phone and basically we need to follow the steps when turning on the phone basically just go next next and everything This is a, I have to say that this is a cheap device, but has good specs for its price. Basically, it's like two gigs of RAM, 16 gigabytes of storage, has 4G network capable. Even though this phone has dual cameras, I don't really think that we have dual cameras here. Just have one camera with that tilty effect, making it all blur from on the side. So the phone should be turned on now. Okay. Setup is new. And we just need to wait our finishing touches. This might take a minute or two. Software update. Okay, so as we can see, we skipped on the Google account. We're gonna hit skip on that. Next. Next. We don't need a fingerprint scanner. Skip. And set up later and there we have it we just to be sure we unlock this device but to be sure we're gonna go on accounts and as you guys can see we don't have any accounts here and this device is fresh doesn't have anything else on it except the original stuff on its firmware so this was it guys, I hope you learned anything from this video, we can do this trick on most of the Doogie devices. So basically this was it and I hope you learned something from this video. This is how you skip an account, a Google account on most of the Doogie devices. If you have any questions, do a comment down on the comment session area and I will try to answer to all of you if you stuck on if you if you're stuck anywhere on this process thank you and do a subscribe on my account